Welcome back to GitHub Awesome. In this week's episode, we're diving into 23 hot repos on GitHub, from tools and dev utilities to self-hosted apps. Smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's jump straight into GitHub Trending Weekly number nine. First up, Alt Send Me. Need to send files fast, privately, and without limits? Alt Send Me is a cross-platform, peer-to-peer file transfer app that makes sharing files totally frictionless. No accounts, no cloud middlemen, just direct encrypted transfers from your machine to anyone, anywhere. It's powered by Iro for reliable NAT hole punching, Quick Plus TLS 1.3 for end-to-end security, and supports resumable downloads. Think of it as AirDrop for everyone. Open source, unlimited, and totally private. Chandra, OCR model that goes way beyond text extraction. This tool doesn't just read documents, it understands their structure, converting images and PDFs into Markdown, HTML, or JSON, while keeping the full layout intact. It can handle handwriting, tables, math formulas, and even forms, reconstructing checkboxes and diagrams with captions like magic. With support for over 40 languages and the choice between local inference on Hugging Face or remote VLLM servers. Code Assist. Imagine an AI coding assistant that doesn't just autocomplete, it actually learns from you. Built by Jensen, Code Assist is a completely private, local AI coding partner that runs right in your browser. No cloud, no data sharing, just you, your code, and an assistant that grows smarter with every keystroke. As you tackle leak code style coding problems, Code Assist watches how you type, refactor, and debug, learning your habits and style over time. What if you could write your app's UI once in TypeScript and get true native performance on iOS, Android, and macOS? Meet Valdi, an open source cross-platform UI framework from Snapchat built to end the trade-off between developer speed and runtime performance. Unlike React Native or Flutter, Valdi doesn't rely on web views or JS bridges. It compiles your declarative TypeScript components directly into native views, giving you the smoothness of pure Swift or Kotlin with the velocity of the web. Note discovery. If you love tools like Notion or Obsidian, but want total privacy and ownership, this one's for you. Note Discovery is a lightweight, self-hosted knowledge base that gives you full control over your notes, wikis, and second brain, all running on your own server. It's fast, beautiful, and built entirely around plain markdown files, so there's no lock-in or subscription in sight. You get instant search, custom themes, plug-in support, and it works seamlessly across desktop and mobile. Next on the list, ThinkUtils. If you're a ThinkPad user running Linux, this app is a total game changer. Built with Tori for lightning fast performance, ThinkUtils gives you complete native control over your ThinkPad's fans, power profiles, CPU performance, and battery health, all wrapped in a beautiful ThinkPad-inspired interface. You can tune fan speeds manually, switch between performance or power saving modes, monitor CPU temps and memory usage in real time. Meet TUIOS a terminal-based window manager that gives you a modern, keyboard-driven interface for managing multiple terminal sessions, all inside your favorite shell. Built in Go using the Charm stack, TUIOS delivers a Vim-style modal workflow with automatic tiling, nine workspaces, and even mouse support for drag, resize, and click interactions. You can copy, search, and scroll through thousands of lines of output using Vim key bindings or fine-tune everything with a simple TomL config. Next up, Sticker Dream. This one's pure creative fun, a voice-activated sticker printer that turns your imagination into real printable art. Just press and hold the button, say what you want, like a cat in astronaut gear, and Sticker Dream uses Whisper to transcribe your voice, then Google Imagen to generate a black and white coloring page version of your idea. Seconds later, it's printed right to a USB thermal printer as a sticker. OpenPCC is an open source framework for provably private AI inference, inspired by Apple's private cloud compute, but fully open and deployable anywhere. It's a fully auditable framework for private AI inference, letting you run any model, open or custom, without exposing your prompts, outputs, or logs. Everything is secured with encrypted streaming, hardware attestation, and unlinkable requests, meaning even your infrastructure can't peek inside. Next up, AgentFS. 
Think of this one as a file system built for AI agents, a brand new abstraction layer where every file, state, and tool invocation lives in one portable SQLite database. AgentFS reimagines how AI systems manage memory and context, offering a POSIX-like virtual file system, a key value store for agent state, and a complete audit trail for transparency and debugging. It's built on Terso, and everything an agent does, from creating files to invoking tools, is fully recorded and queryable with SQL. Next, Kimi Writing Agent. Meet an AI that doesn't just write, it thinks. Powered by the Kimi K2 thinking model, this autonomous writing agent plans and executes creative projects all on its own, from full-length novels to short story collections. You can watch it write in real time, streaming its reasoning as it crafts scenes, dialogues, and chapters with smart context compression to handle long stories effortlessly. It manages its own files, resumes interrupted sessions. Next up, 8milbabe.local. Ever tried sharing a huge video only to hit upload limits? This tool fixes that locally, privately, and fast. 8mb.local is a self-hosted GPU accelerated video compressor inspired by 8mba video, but designed to run entirely on your own machine. Just drag and drop a video, pick your target size, like 8 megabyte, 25 megabytes, or 100 megabytes, and it automatically handles the rest using AV1, HEVC, or H.264 encoders. It's the perfect tool for creators, devs who want small, shareable videos. Treamed. It's like the tree command, but for your markdown files. Trium gives you a beautiful terminal interface where you can explore long.md documents using an expandable, collapsible heading tree with a live content view beside it. Navigate like a pro with Vim-style controls, syntax highlighting, and real-time filtering. Jump between sections instantly, bookmark spots, or collapse entire chapters when you just need an overview. You can even switch to CLI mode for scripting. Ladder the Python framework for building multi-agent systems. Think of it as microservices for AI agents, where agents can communicate, delegate tasks, and work in parallel. Ladder runs in two modes, coordinator-orchestrator mode for dynamic autonomous workflows, one agent coordinating specialists in real time, sequential workflow mode for predictable step-by-step -step pipelines. Ladder brings observability and horizontal scalability. Linux Desktop Gremlins, Kurt Velasco's desktop companions, now reborn in PySide and Qt6 for your Linux. These mischievous little creatures wander your desktop, react to your mouse. They'll make cute noises when you interact or random ones when you ignore them for too long, just to remind you who really runs your desktop. Whether you're coding, gaming, or procrastinating, these gremlins will definitely keep you company or chaos. Neuraxon is a bio-inspired neural network framework that goes beyond traditional perceptrons by simulating trinary neural dynamics, excitatory, neutral, and inhibitory signals, just like in the brain. With Neuraxon, you can build custom networks with configurable neurons, synapses, and plasticity, manually toggle inputs, and watch how signals flow, adjust dopamine, serotonin, acetylcholine, and norepinephrine in real time for neuromodulation experiments. See all this in stunning 3D. Next up, Stage. Bring your creative ideas to life with this web-based canvas editor. Upload images, add text overlays, customize backgrounds, and export high-quality graphics, all directly in your browser. Design tools let you create social media graphics, banners, or open graph images with one-click presets and in-browser high-resolution exports up to 5x scale. Fully responsive and real-time, Stage turns your browser into a powerful canvas. Next up, Deep OCR. If you're into OCR research, this open source project is a must-see. Deep OCR is reproduction of the DeepSeq OCR model. It achieves OCR accuracy while using only around 250 vision tokens, thanks to its deep encoder architecture, combining SAM window attention, clip global attention, and a 16 times convolutional compression for efficient high-resolution processing. Deep OCR comes production ready with training pipelines, evaluation scripts, and pre-trained checkpoints. GermCAD is a browser-based 3D CAD renderer where you define your models entirely in YAML syntax. Use simple primitives like cuboids, cylinders, spheres, cones, and toroids. Combine them with Boolean operations and visualize everything in real time with an interactive 3D viewer. It also supports reusable parametric stamps, 
coordinate system options, wireframe mode, and STL export for 3D printing. GermCAD lets you code your designs instead of fighting with complex CAD UIs. ChatTutor is a visual and interactive AI tutor equipped with an electronic whiteboard, bringing the tools of real-world teaching, chalkboards, diagrams, and interactive aids directly to your screen. Unlike traditional text-only chatbots, ChatTutor helps students understand STEM concepts visually, combining explanations with diagrams, sketches, and step-by-step -step demonstrations. It's like having a hands-on AI teacher who can write, draw, and guide you through problems in real time. Next, CivIs, a performance analyzer for all your NPM packages. CivIs scans your code base automatically to detect issues that slow down your application, from memory leaks and blocking operations to sequential async calls and bundle bloat. It's zero config, blazing fast thanks to a Rust-based parser and provides AST-accurate detection with actionable suggestions. You get beautiful reports in console, JSON, or interactive HTML, plus VS Code integration to jump straight to problematic code. Next up, Domains Lookup, a simple Node.js tool to quickly check domain availability using the GoDaddy API. Perfect for finding those short, catchy domains before someone else snaps them up. Lightweight, fast, and developer-friendly. Just run it, check availability, and grab your perfect domain. Parlance, a decentralized P2P messaging app that works on both local networks and the internet. Parlance uses UDP multicast for LAN discovery and a lightweight WebSocket bootstrap server for cross-network peer discovery. Once peers are found, all messages happen directly over TCP without relying on centralized infrastructure. You can run multiple instances on the same machine, choose between local or internet discovery, and enjoy real-time messaging straight between peers.